Now then peeps, uh, today we're at uh, the old RAF Driffield site, uh, actually called Staxton Wold site. Uh, don't confuse that with uh, RAF Staxton Wold near Scarborough because I can guarantee if you jump the fence there and try and take photographs you'll have uh, the Ministry of Defence, Military Police all over you and you're quite liable to get arrested for trespass. Right, so I'm going to start taking a look around. Right, here we have the accommodation section. Right, we'll check, check it out. Right, back out again now for you. Right, <coughs> just uh, wandering through. This is like an uh, like a big industrial section, like what we just went through with. Ha ha! What is that? It's a good drawing. Thirteen for the Fed, eighty-two. Yeah, well. I don't know if you can see properly because of the sun, but uh, this section seems to have uh, blast walls around it. Yeah, looks like blast walls. Right, going here. Obviously, something in there that needs to be secure. Foam mattress. Ah. Uh, Got a feeling I know what this place is. I think this is uh, the stores. Hang on, what's that? Ah, I think my suspicions may have been confirmed. Yeah. Quartermaster's Department, Alamein Barracks, Students, Bedding Card. Ah, so it is the stars on this, but... Uh.
cellar. Oh, shall I? Yes. Glad the hell it's cool down here. Not as in that's awesome, dude, as in it's cold. Ha-ha! I was actually looking for this, uh, this hatchway, for about the last hour. I'd seen it on a photograph from 28 years later. Take the water trap. Pretty thick metal door. And what the old one's for? to get a better view of the door. Yeah, it's quite a heavy duty door like. Yeah, still got some of the original lighting as well. Yeah, there's the door. I've just actually closed it just so you can see it closed. 